Welcome to Inner Beauty Healing Channel for the upcoming May 7th, 2020 Scorpio Full Moon. I'm Francesca Ordonia Hollingsworth and I'm an Inner Beauty Healer and I help heal the emotional blocks that stop you from prosperity in the area of business, personal growth, and presence using the divination arts of astrology, numerology, human design, and the I Ching. I'm going to start by telling you a story, and it is Beauty the Inside Story, and this is the story you play in your head, and it's called COVID-19, A Breath of Fresh Air. What to do? Can I do? How do I do? Drummed mind over and over again. Do I stay in? Do I go out? Round and around in a circle, mind went. Voice, mind is stuck in a mental loop. I need help. I have no energy. I need a new way of being. A breath of fresh air, said Clacy. You have one, said Voice. I do, exclaimed Clacy. Yes, you do, said voice. Are you ready for a new way of being? Let's take a breath of fresh air together and let go of stress. Take a deep cleansing breath and imagine you're collecting your stress from the base of your spine to the top of your head, down to the base of the spine and letting go of your stress. Do it one more time letting go of your stress, and we'll begin. So, the sun is at 17 degrees in Taurus. This is the gate of two, of number two, which at the lowest vibration, it is dislocation. So if you are feeling dislocated, you are in the fear vibration of the sun. The gift vibration is orientation, and the high vibration is unity. At the opposite end is the moon. It is in the gate of one, which is at the lowest vibration, entropy. At the gift vibration, freshness, and at the highest vibration, beauty. So what does this Scorpio full moon going to do? Scorpio full moons are all about shining the light through opposition in order to transform at a very deep level. The purpose of Scorpio is to go deep inside, bring up the muck, bring it up to the light so that you can discern what is no longer serving you and letting it go. That being said, let's look at the gates. So the two gates at the lowest vibrations are dislocation and entropy. So if you are feeling dislocated, like you're in the wrong place, you're not sure where to go or what to do or how to be, you are in the fear vibration. And if you are be, your energy is being drained and you can't move, Yes, you are in the fear vibration, and I'm sure it's not comfortable. So if you want out of that cycle, that, that mental loop that mind is in, the way to get out of it is take a breath of fresh air. How do I know that? Well, one, I did call this COVID-19 a breath of fresh air. And the way COVID-19 is manifesting in the physical body is it is eliminating the ability to breathe, to bring in a breath of fresh air. So with this opposition, it is saying, take a breath of fresh air, bring it in and allow yourself to be open to the beauty of the situation so that you can unify your inner and outer self and have a world that makes sense to you. Okay? So that is the simple solution to what 
is kind of happening right now and if you kind you take some of those tips of taking a breath of fresh air allowing yourself the permission to see through the lens of beauty in order to unite your mind body and spirit it will help you transform what is not no longer serving you and the other tip I have for you is to appreciate a breath of fresh air appreciate the the situation you are in now because I can tell you if your mind is doing what the mind was doing in uh, the story keeping going around and around in circle it's going in this circle because it wants to see what the future is but the mind needs to be here now seeing what is here now and working with you w with where your life is now not with where it's going to go because i can guarantee right now because of all the things that are occurring there's there is uncertainty and the best place to be when there is uncertainty in the future is to be here now with what you actually know what is going on inside you and shows up on your table so if that i hope that little tip helped you for this full moon if you want more tips hop on over to my website at innerbeautyhealing.us that's dot us not dot com and check out my blog and podcast because they will give you extra tips that will help support you with this full moon and if you want more personal individual help Hop on over to our COVID-19 Energy Help page and sign up for our complimentary new and full moon group sessions. COVID-19 Energy Help. Yeah, we will be having that, me and my sister, Reverend Dr. Trinity, at 6 p.m. Pacific time on the new and full moon. So this week, this time, it will be on May 7th. Sign up at least 24 hours before so that I can get the content, the information to you to join. Okay, bye for now and have a great and wonderful moon. Much light and love.